the choice of surgery is going to be in part contingent upon local resource availability. The robotic platform may not be available uh, uh, every time it's desired in a given situation, and, and therefore laparoscopy is much more readily available throughout the world. Uh, but there are parts of the world even laparoscopy isn't available, and, and then it ends up being a, a laparotomy. Fortunately, in terms of the oncologic outcomes, we see that they're very similar amongst open laparoscopic surgery and robotic surgery. An adjunct to laparoscopic surgery is the transanal total mesorectal excision, which allows, in my opinion, and from much of the data, a better operation from the transanal aspect deep in the pelvis than could be done laparoscopically, particularly in an obese male. So I think the choice comes down to what's available and, of course, what technology uh, the surgeon is most familiar with using because if somebody is only used to laparoscopy and they're told you've got to use a robot, that could be a problem. So it depends upon the learning, what, what education the surgeon has had. So it's, it's largely resource dependent, both training and availability.